Hello, my name is Amy Sturkey. I'm a pediatric physical therapist with about 30 years of clinical practice, and I can't be with Myla right now, so uh, I've asked her mother to do some videos for me. On this video, I asked her to line up a series of pillows, like might be on the bed or on the couch, and have Myla walk across them. Um, so let's just uh, watch the video. Good job. Do it again. Do it again. Good job. Do it one more time. Well, what I'd really hoped was that with the pillows spaced apart a little bit, that Mala would um, walk from one pillow to the next pillow to the next pillow to the next pillow and sort of like the floor is lava not walk on the floor in between um, so it looked like that was maybe a little bit challenging but it still looked like the variety of surfaces did challenge her balance which was thumbs up uh, I did ask the mom to make it a little bit easier by making sure that the pillows as much as possible were different colors on the floor significantly so it was easily more easily visually seen for Mala. I thought she did pretty good. On the next video I asked her to go ahead since it seemed like when she touched was walking on the floor that it gave her more balance to go ahead and smoosh the pillows all up together so that there was no floor in between to challenge her balance just a little bit more. So let's watch that video. Yeah. Oh, try again. <laughs> All right. Go again. Oh, try again. Oh, crash. Try again. Good job. All right, one more time. Come on. Go. Yay. Say ta da. Good job. Oh, crash. Good job. Okay, say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Well, you could see my hypothesis was correct. Um, yes, it was a lot harder for Myla because she had no intermittent stability to walk on. And that all those different pillows, since they were all different, had different levels of bounciness and unsteadiness, which really challenged her balance. It ended up being a very good balance exercise and something that many people could do at home easily with just the pillows they have laying around. I hope this was helpful and we'll look forward to seeing you next time. Thanks. Bye-bye.